everybody. Welcome to The Home Show. That's right. We actually have a show called The Home the Show. The Home Show. And I, we are at the Central Florida September 2019 Home Show and Expo. And so... And what a great show it has been. It is a big good show, lots right? Lots of vendors. Oh, lots, my gosh. Lots, lots, lots of vendors. A lot of great products. Really cool stuff. Yeah. So... And um, some new and unique stuff. Yep. I mean, I don't know about how new, but it is definitely some unique stuff. Yes. Um, so well, this isn't stuff that you can find at the store every day. Exactly. So we're going to start off the show just opposite of everybody else. We're going to give you our five top picks. Now, they're my, maybe they're, they're my top picks. top five Because she picks. likes the toe, what is I it? like the toe rings and, and the jewelry and... Um, uh, the hair, they have this hair wand that's really nice. It doesn't they give have you hair. Purse. They it... have purses and they have bonsai trees. Those are like, yes. But these are other cool stuff. Well, there is one in here that's one of my favorites. Yeah, there is one yes. in here. So, I'm going to start off right here. This yeah. is the Hiko stick. Okay. Right? And this so Hiko stick. I don't know stick, what it is. Okay. So you tell me. It is to help you build hand eye coordination. So you see how they're different colors, right? So what you do is you get somebody else with you and then you throw it and say, right hand blue. So that person has to catch it with their right hand. Oh my. Or you say one. left hand white and then they catch the left hand white. What it does, it helps you quick with hand eye coordination. Wow. Yeah. Well, um, that's kind of cool. And the guys that do it are. Does it work? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. The guy's over in a sling right now. So and that's the oh. guy we interviewed yesterday. <laughs> no, he had rotator cuff surgery. So, you know, so the guy actually made this because um, he was playing football with a bunch of guys, you mm -hmm. know, older guys, and they were throwing the ball and they couldn't catch the ball, and they, and they were having issues. So he was working on a way to do a um, a, a hand-eye coordination, and what a great way. Now. The original one he made out of doesn't look similar to this, but it was all made out of PVC. So when you missed, Ouch. that hurt. He goes, Ouch. that was a lot of bloody knuckles and bloody hands and bloody stuff. So, and it's light. Look, That's, feel that. It doesn't weigh anything. Oh, yeah. So That's if you get hit cool. by it, it's not going to hurt okay. you. But the guys are from Florida. They're local boys here. Nice. And that you can go online and, and actually stay watching the whole show today because of the whole show today is going to have these products in here and more, of course. And more. So and some of my favorites. So this is really good for, like, martial artists, too, you know? Yes. A lot of hand-eye coordination yes. there. Yes, right. Um, even tennis or something yep. like that. That's that's very cool. I always had a problem playing tennis, as you know, because uh -huh. we've been married for a long uh -huh. time and we've never played tennis because I can't. You know, I'm okay with hand-eye coordination, but put a tennis racket in my hand. Forget it. I like, yeah. You know, or baseball, same thing. I right. can't seem to. But this is good. This is really yep. cool. And you can. And they've actually. You know how cornhole became a big thing. Yes. Well, now you can actually thing. make that right there. Is there's a they they actually have a game and it's uh, and, and again a uh, hico clicks.com i believe it is and we'll actually put the we'll put the link down there yeah, is um you can actually play a game with this first person to 11 it wins by two and each each color has a point system oh neat so yeah it, it's it's pretty cool really really cool and you know what and it gets the kids outside They're, playing exactly. away from video exactly. games and there working you on go. their hand-eye coordination yep that's a great that's a great thing great thing yeah. I, I love the fact that they're local guys Right. right. So the next thing, let's talk about your fit because this is one of yours. Candle. So this is a soy candle from um, ha Hammock Treasures, which I absolutely love. This one is called um, Beach Blanket, and it's made like a beach blanket. See, it's striped. This just one of she has, and it's their soy candle. She has many um, scents and um, sizes and things like that. So I learned something new about candles. Uh, when you first burn the candle, you're supposed to let it go until the whole first layer, so to speak, is all melted. Um, if you blow it out before it gets to the edges, then that's when you're going to get the hollowness that goes down into the middle, the tunnel, so to speak, that goes down the middle. As long as the first, so that's its memory, the first layer is, is melted, then it will remember that and its memory and the rest of it goes down. Now a soy candle, I learned, a soy candle um, burns cleaner than a paraffin um, and longer. Oh, really? 
cleaner and longer. So you know how I you get that, that black soot and stuff? Yes. Right. You will get it, but not as much with something like this. And it burns longer than a paraffin candle does. So So this is the first time I've been able to walk past a candle booth no, you store don't like or anything else. And the scent doesn't knock you over and give you a migraine. It triggered for me, it triggers migraines. I know. So I, I, know. I, I like if I go to a mall, yeah. I avoid the Yankee Candle Shop. Oh, or something. I can't do he it. Go, he walks on the other side. Walks of, on the other of, side of the mall to avoid that store. It is. It's a lot of strong scents coming out of that, and all right. of them at once. You know, it's overwhelming. It's a trigger. But, but hers are very clean I like, and very I like smooth them. and yep. um, gentle. I like the yeah. So this next thing is is Angel, over here is a dude, high and dry, mailbox insert. All right, so, okay, how many times have you gone down? I'm going to open this up. How many times have mailbox. you gone down to the mailbox, and next thing you know, it's raining really hard, or it's mm. crazy, and you reach in to grab your mail, and what happens? It's all soggy. You're, it's all soggy, right? It's no good. So, I'm going to put this down here. Hold on. That's even better. So, what happens is, is this thing goes into your mailbox and it's and, and it's expandable. So, it, it's it's not oh, like okay. it's, it, you can make it wider or or longer. Longer. Look at there. Right? So it goes in there. Your mail sits on top of that. The water's draining out of it. And now your mail's dry. Oh, now, to me, that's you see cool. a need, fill a need, right? Right. So this guy has literally, Angel's his name, he has literally done this. We're going to put all the information on there about, about all of these products. So this, to me, is it's simple. It's easy. He he even got to sit down with Kevin Harrington on Shark Tank, one of those Shark Tank guys, and give it the pitch. So that, to me, that is really, 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 yeah, really cool. cool, right? So um, now, do this one yeah, next? let's talk about that one because so, that one is cool. Yes, this one he came back to the booth all excited about. Can I take it out of the yeah, box? Yeah, absolutely. So this is called the greatest has arrived. It is the greatest, greatest cooking. However, it's great, G-R-A-T-E. There's and there's no a reason for that. It because it's all about grating That's right. food. Right? Yep. So this this is a this is a husband wife team that are they're both they're both foodies, they're both chefs. <laughs> and they're like, there's gotta be a better way to grate and the whole you know and, Without and get your food. Your, yep, your fingers exactly. all bloody, right? So, so they have this nifty beautiful. That is so cool. Yeah, let me see if Rob can get that in there with the yeah, other camera. He can. So because of the little nubs that you see inside there, right? Those you can actually take garlic, you can take uh, um um Onions, or uh, I mean, they had all kinds of stuff. They had strawberries. You actually wow. rub it inside there, and the strawberries. And when you're done, it's a pure puree. They had jalapenos that he and she loves hot. So do. the hotter, the better. <laughs> so they were in there, and I mean, it got down. You could look. You could actually move it around and see the oils, and see the seeds, and everything. And you did. Then you just so take that. Add you know, it to your cooking. Yep. Add it to your whatever. So check so this out. So tell me what this part all of right, it is. So this right here. Now here is. Here's your brush, right? There's a little brush that you once you oh. once you've done your grading, you can actually get in there and you clean it all up, and it's okay. bendy, so you can bend it to way the way you want it to be bent, right? So then then you need to go in there and you push it, right? And then you just drain it off right into your into now your food or whatever. This I thought was ingenious. So you take so say you're doing garlic, right? Take your garlic in there and then you roll it. Like this? No way! And it Are separates you all the stuff. Nope. Me? And it can, and it comes nice. with. So they throw that in to do that. So nice. anything that you've got to get in How and separate. How simple is that? Is that cool? This is the this is the time when I usually say, "Why didn't I think of this?" Right. This is this is an awesome idea. Right. And how simple is that? Simple. Right. How many times do we sit there just peeling the garlic cloves one at a time? Yep. And then and then sitting there chopping them up, so thinly slicing them. And you them don't got to do time. that. You do it right here. You just do that. That is that so cool. Is, I'm telling you, that is really cool. You're right. I like so that our too. last piece is a service. You know, I know. And and this was a hard one because because our friends from Polka da, uh, Polka, Polka Dogs Pet Rescue. They're here and we love them. And They're the ones with the wheelchairs, the little doggies in the wheelchairs. Maverick, and stuff, and we love them. Maverick, Maverick Goose, Goose, and um, 
Iceman. Ice it's really happy. <laughs> That's the doggy's name. He's, he's really happy, but they went with the whole right, the, top the whole gun Top Gun thing. thing. So okay, so as much as we love them, um, we love our animals. We all love our, and our, sometimes our animals are out of control. Right. They're a little high energy, or it just gets and, and you and you really want to train them better. So I met Matt, who is the now this is a franchise type deal. Okay. So sit means sit dog training right these now i talked to matt who's here in orlando and he uh he says that you know what you can actually drop the dog off and they will help train but they want you to be they don't really want you to do that if you know if you don't have time if you have time to put into it because they want to make sure that the leadership is you is you not them so what happens is even if you have to do the drop off they will actually still work with you a couple more times to help that leadership go over to you so you become the alpha, right? right. But he has these beautiful, these, I think they're German Shepherd. Uh, they're like four or five years old. Absolutely one of the coolest dogs ever. I know. He was so cute. He, he has these, yep. these, they have these tubes set up. Yep. And he was so cute. Every time a person comes over, he would jump up and he would run through his little tube. Yep. <laughs> like, like and look what I can he do. Was showing what I can his, do. And, you know, so normally cute. dogs like that won't just come up to people. Uh, Mike, my photographer that was with me, my videographer was over with me. Right on him, literally la- laid on him, laid on his feet. So Aww. he had to, so he had to, uh, uh, to pet him in whole nine yards. It was really, really cool. So uh, again, and, and that interview is going to be in this show, so you can actually go and find these people. And there are there are franchises. So they're all over the state. Kind of. There's all. They are. They do have some in Tampa, and there's and there's a locator. So if you go to sitmeansit.com. Yeah, sit, sit means sit.com. And then you can actually go in there, put your zip code in there, and find where other people are at. Are there because you know what? All dogs want to be, um, they want to be good. Let's face yep. it. Just like ch- they want to be good, like kids. Um, they just don't know how sometimes. They don't. So as long as they have some coaching and some um, training by professional trainers, you will love your dog, the one that was driving you crazy. You will learn to yep. love that dog. Because Absolutely. They know how to train them. So that's good. And I like that you said that they train them to you. Yes. Um, so they that you put a little bit of time into it as well so that the dog responds to you. Right. Exactly. And that's a great thing. What a great thing. idea. All right. So here's the thing. We gave you our top five picks. Now you watch the rest of the show and you decide what you like. But before the show's over, we'll be back, and then we will uh, see you guys off. Thanks for watching The Home Show. Now, let's not move. Hi, I'm Delyn Gaston with WeBeam TV, and we are back at the Tampa Home Show with another great vendor. I have with me Charles from Bin Bathers. What is Bin Bathers, you may ask? Hi, Charles. Uh, Welcome. Look, I got a cool little squishy Uh, trash can. Tell us about Bin Bathers. uh, Bin Bathers is a company that will come to your home or your commercial business. Uh, We clean trash, recycle bins, dumpsters. We also do pressure washing, uh, sidewalks, driveways. even patios if that needs to be there you go there you go so um the concept we we're talking a little bit in the break the um cleaning out the like you said people have diapers or things like that you don't think about the bacteria and stuff that if you wash it out yourself right yeah if you um you have diapers uh, uh poo bags that may burst in your trash bins um that you know increase bacteria um salmonella um so it's, it's better for us for us to come out and clean your bins because if you clean your bins you're throwing the bacteria into your yards which is where your child is going to be running around playing small right. children uh, even your pets right so you're contaminating your area so with us we come in we're clean all that polluted water goes into our, tra- our tank which is on our truck and once we finish for the day we we'll take that water and we we'll take it to the port where they have a waste section at the port oh, where we pick up the water. How about that? I was wondering, I was going to ask you that too. So tell us about the truck because this folks sounds really cool. I just want to see it in action. Tell us about the truck. Um, <laughs> it's a small Zuzu truck that will drive around. Um, it has a lift just just like your tru- uh, trash and recycle trucks. So what the truck does is pick the bins up and it power washes the bins out inside. We also have a wand that we use that we pressure wash the outside of your bin, so that is clean as well at the same time. Oh, yeah, because a lot of the stuff gets out on that, too, as well. And it helps, you know, some people have a lot of paint or, you know, maybe some color that gets on the outside of cans. You know, with the pressure washer, it usually 
get most of that stuff off. Yeah. yeah. And some of these neighborhoods, I know that you guys work a lot in South Tampa and stuff. Some of the neighborhoods, they're pretty particular about, uh, <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. They're measuring how tall your grass is. They're probably looking at how well your cans are taken care of. <laughs> well, I haven't uh, heard anything on that part yet, but I'm pretty sure it is. Yeah. I mean, you do, in some places, you would get fined for having, you know, high grass if you haven't cut it in a certain amount of time. So I think we'd come to the point of, hey, if those trash cans are dirty, you'll get a, end up getting a fine for that as well. Right, probably. Yeah. So tell us all about, uh, you also do, in addition to cleaning, so on the commercial side, the uh, dumpsters and dumpsters, stuff. Dumpsters, yes. Um, you know, we have, uh, what we do, we'll come out, uh, once the trash has been empty, we would pressure wash the inside of the, the, tra- the dumpsters out. We also have a vacuum cleaner that's on the truck that specializes pulling that nasty water out of there into the tanks as well. So um, I would imagine if a you know business owner, let's say a restaurant owner or something uh, in the Tampa Bay area, whatever, do they like have you set up on a regular schedule? So you come like the day of trash, you know that afternoon or something. Especially restaurants, I would imagine a lot of garbage gets right. put in there. Talk yes, about, I do. I do know. have one company for sure that um, we just started, and we do have a particular day uh, every Friday right. that we'll go out and, and clean. But sometimes the biggest issue with that, even you know, it kind of pushes us back a little bit because you know dealing with the city of Tampa, sometimes the trash trucks and recycle don't always uh, operate on, yeah. you know, a timely manner. So. Uh-huh. But that would be a really good um, thing for some of the uh, restaurant owners to set up with you, huh? To come out on a regular basis. On a regular to, basis, yeah, yes, absolutely. With a lot of food and things being right. dumped in the dumpsters, yes. Right, yeah. And, and, and sure it keeps the rats away and it rats, keeps the, the raccoons, the raccoons uh, the and stuff like that that, you know, incense. don't always just dump out. Yeah, exactly. Right. And then you also do power washing, for, as you said, for sidewalks or right. driveways Sidewalk, or things driveways, like that. Sidewalk uh, driveways. We can also do patios. We do have a portable uh, pressure washer that we can carry Excellent. around just to get to the area where the truck won't make it to them. Okay, perfect. And um, where you guys, like, what's your, give me a little bit of an idea of your territory. Um, territory, we go as far as west as St. Pete, um, far as uh, east as Lithia, and up north as uh, far as to Wesley Chapel, just before you get to Wesley Chapel. Perfect. So right in the Tampa Bay area. Tampa That's Bay excellent. Area. Okay, good. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for being with us, Charles. Thank you. Good I luck really with uh, everything, and um, we'll see you soon. Thank you. Hey everybody, we're back here at the March 2019 Home and Garden Show. I don't know, less garden, more home, right? I think a lot more home. I haven't seen that garden part yet. I haven't either, nope. but that's okay, you know, because we look at some cool vendors like Nick Massett from Coast to Coast. So tell me about Coast to Coast because your booth is awesome. I appreciate it, Johnny. Well, first of all, thanks for having us out. Yeah, you know, man. And it's really cool to be part of this home show. It's our first one. We've uh, only been in the uh, Florida Clearwater area here uh, for about four or five months. Uh, we are a full retail shop. We carry everything reclaimed that you can think about. Uh, everything's torn down from 1800, 17, 1800 uh, year old barns. Wow. And, uh, uh, like I said, everything's 100% reclaimed. Uh, tobacco, tobacco barns. Uh, I was gonna say, is now is that all just Florida, or do you branch out to other states? Well, so we are a two-man company. We got another uh, store out in Phoenix, Arizona. So Coast to Coast Barnwood, that's kind of where yeah. we get the name. Uh, my partner's out there holding down the fort. We're pretty new here, we're finding out it's kind of an untapped market, and we're really excited to offer our product. We carry lots of different uh, uh, wall applications, lots of different mantle applications beams, siding, lots of different product that you can use for in your home or even in your garden if you'd like to. Oh, so, okay, so this can be used inside or outside? Technically, yes. You know, people will do, they'll build, you know, uh, you know, pool houses or they'll, they'll do roofing on pool houses or, you know, even do little gardening boxes. But most of the time we find that a lot of our stuff comes with the wall applications. That's what okay, we so pride what in. is your, okay, you got a mission on here. What's that mission? Our mission is to be green, stay green, and be part of that project for us because, you know, we're not, uh, uh, you know, we're not tearing down trees and, and cutting wood. You know, we're taking old reclaimed barn wood and we're turning it into a new niche product right. that people can use in, in, as a designer, uh, you know, features in their homes. Oh, that is awesome. Absolutely phenomenal. Now, how much product do you actually, I mean, is it, you get truckloads in, you get 
double truckloads in or no wait we got to go find stuff before we can build that for you no everything's sourced out of the midwest kentucky tennessee river valley ohio all throughout there that's so good we're getting wood. lots of really lots of good oaks lots right. of good poplars lots of different mixed material and that's one thing that we pride ourselves in is quantity and quality you know we hit it from both ends we carry over fifty thousand feet pretty much at all times so we are fully locked and loaded with any of the product that you might want to use for your project at, at, at your home. So uh, where can people find you? So we're right off uh, right off US 19 and Nursery Road, 2596 Nursery Road, Clearwater. Uh, we're open six days a week, closed on Tuesdays. And uh, You're open on Sundays? Yeah, well, we're open on Sundays, man. So they're open on Sundays, but don't come on Tuesday because I'm just telling you right now, you ain't getting no wood. That's when and we're out Not here. having wood's kind of an important thing. Yeah, Mondays and Tuesdays we do a lot of our installations. Okay. So, uh, you know, we're, we're, we're helping homeowners out as well there. You know, you can come in, pick out your product, you know, design your feature wall or design your perfect, uh, you know, mantle or whatever it is. And we can also come out and, and install. If we I was going to say, got the so you're, you, you're, you install as well as sell the product. Absolutely. That is absolutely phenomenal. And you know what? You can get them at coasttocoastbarnwood.com, which is absolutely the coolest, one of the coolest websites I've seen in a long time, which is really kind of cool. So, Nick, Johnny, man, thanks appreciate for coming it. over, brother. We appreciate it. And if you're not here, we're going to be rolling this tonight. We're going to be, if you're not here, you need to come tomorrow and look at their, their booth alone is what caught my eye. Yeah. I'm we, thinking to myself, there's my studio sitting right there. So um, we'll be back after this and we'll talk to some more cool people here at the uh, 2019 March Home Show. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to WeBeam TV. We're at the Home Show, the 2019 Tampa Bay Home Show. And I ran into somebody yesterday. This is the second day, by the way. I ran into somebody yesterday that's got a product here that actually we've known. We've actually interviewed people before. But you're a different line. And now we're going to talk to Miss Stephanie Jackson. Hello. And she is with Hempworks. Building her empire. Now, I, you know, as soon as I hear that, I hear da 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 <laughs> yes. da da da. But, okay, so you guys, okay, so this is how how long it's been since I, you only had the oils and the vitamins at that point in time. You did not have the coffee or the snacks. But I want to know. This is a great product. Yes. But I want to know why you got into this, the, 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 uh, the whole world of the CBD world. Okay. So um, I started HempWorks about six months ago, and my why is my son. Okay. So um, he is a senior now in, um, in college at mm -hmm. the Art Institute, and he has suffered you know, from anxiety, depression, a lot of tension um, for a few years now. And uh, he basically came to me stressed out with school and whatnot. And um, he's never been medicated. We've always tried the all natural approach. Right, which is the best way. Yes. And um, I was in uh, North Tampa. I went to a float studio um, to do sleep deprivation. Right. And they had a CBD product there, um, not Hemp Works. Right. I did not know a whole lot about it, um, it was marketed really well. And I bought it because okay. um, just the day before my son was asking me for something like something this. Something to help. And I always feel like, you know, if that's put in front of you. But it was a, it was a journey. It was a path to get to HempWorks, basically. Right. And so he tried it. Um, I did a little bit more research. It, it basically it knocked him out. Right. He was out like, and that's not what <laughs> no. CBD is supposed to do. No, exactly. And uh, so uh, I threw that away. And but the very next day, um, my sister-in-law, who lives in uh, Fort Smith, Arkansas, uh, put her testimony out on Facebook. Did not even know she was taking HempWorks uh, wow. CBD. And she has suffered from pan panic, uh, like anxiety attacks. Right. And within days, she actually had an appointment um, to get on antidepressants. Oh, she wow. had an appointment. So she had one oil. foot in the door going, I'm going to be medicated for the rest of my life. This is going to suck. Yes. And she um, was having to wait like weeks, you know, to even get in to see a doctor. And she started taking the CBD and within like a couple days. Um, all of her tension, her anxiety, everything started to just dissipate. Right. And she was a changed person. She had suffered for years 
Um, my son, then I saw her testimony. I jumped on it. I asked her, hey, what do I need to do? Um, she brought me into it. I ordered, got it to Logan, and then he has slept better. He doesn't, his anxiety, everything is gone. Um, I also brought in my sister, who's here with me today as well. She's over there taking pictures. She is. And she's um, also suffered from anxiety, depression. Um, she is completely off medication as well. Wow. Um, That's a huge like, testimonial yeah, right there by it's, itself. It's been life-changing. For me, um, I had sleep issues um, due to other women, uh, things that we have to deal with at that time of our life. Right. And um, I no longer have that. I had tried all natural approach, which it would come and go with certain like neutral nutritional supplements, right. you know, that I would get organic products, but it would come and come and go. And um, uh, I, I don't have those, um, you know, night sweats. I don't have all those That's uh, hot in things. Here. Yes. It's hot in here. All of a sudden, it I, got I really have... hot. Yeah. <laughs> I, I... So all of yep. it's gone, and I sleep. I don't wake up at two or three o'clock in the morning anymore. Um, so all of those things, those are my why. That's, and um, everybody who I have introduced to this product um, within six months, it's completely changed our lives. Right. And um, so now, uh, you know, for years I have. I dove into yoga. I've done it. Uh, I do wellness and health coaching and um, a little bit of Ayurveda. So I am all into the holistic modalities. Right. And, but I never had a product. Right. So this product was put in front of me. And um, so six months, this is my first vendor event that has been completely uh, successful. I mean, this is what I have in front is like the products basically that I have left. Yeah. And people are flocking to it. They want to know. Um, they want to know what CBD is going to do for them. Uh, Hemp Works uh, has, uh, you know, kind of a, a small uh, variety right now. But we're right. actually in, in October. We have our Hemp Works uh, third annual convention in Las Vegas, and they are about to roll out. Um, a few more products. Um, she's right. kind of given us a little bit of teaser here and there. Right. But uh, we're going to learn what they're going to uh, expand upon. Right. And that is also going to be offered in 200 countries wow. global. So you're real, so, the market opened up for them, that, that, which is yes. absolutely phenomenal. I, I, I followed you guys from from uh, a year and a half ago yes. when, we, when we had uh, another company on, that, uh, another Hemp Works uh, group. And all they had was these. That's yes. it. That's all they had. Yes. So we offer um, the white lid is THC free. Um, the black lid has 0.03% THC. Uh, the THC free products come in peppermint. Um, and the uh, full spectrum has your natural, your cinnamon, and right. your peppermint flavor. Yep. Um, we also have like nutritional sprays. And that's how hemp works. You know, they started with the nutritional right. sprays. And then... Uh, Jenna Zweigel and Josh Wagle, who uh, founded um, HempWorks side of it, uh, they came into this um, because of her story. And if you go online to right. you know HempWorks.com, you can hear all about their amazing journey and what they're doing to change lives. It's we we offer a pure product that is um, there's no fillers. We have hemp oil as our carrier oil, and there's CBD. Uh, I, what I'm trying to do this weekend is, yeah, I want to, you know, sell the product, um, but I'm creating relationships and I'm educating people on what to look out right. for. You don't want uh, filler products that have um, coconut and olive oil and sunflower right. oil and all those type of oils were um, in the first bottle that I experimented with when I didn't right. know a whole lot about CBD. And uh, that's what I'm doing is I'm trying to educate the public and let them know that we have an amazing product that is literally changing lives daily. Right. So, okay, let's talk about your products. Now, you have you, you have the with and without, the THC, right? Yes. You have the coffee. Now, the coffee I had heard about, but it hadn't hit the market yet. So yes. now it's, so let, let's talk about the coffee real quick. So I'm a the, coffee guy. Yes. The coffee, you get a, a month's worth supply in this box. Um, I'm actually selling them individual packs today. Um, yesterday I sold quite a few of them. And so I'm doing like little bundle packages. Uh, and for those that maybe just want to try it first, right. 
And uh, so it has five milligrams of CBD in the coffee packet, and that is your daily dose. Uh, if you didn't want to take the oil sublingually, you just wanted the coffee, and then we have a keto creamer that okay. comes in mocha, vanilla, oh, nice. um, and hazelnut, and it's amazing. Keto friendly. That's it's awesome. Keto friendly. Yeah. And um, this is also, it has um, a booster. It says chaga mushrooms in it, which oh. I, I, that people kind of look at me, but I'm like, no, no, Shrooms, no. It, dude. It, 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 it's, it's amazing. Um, it has your amino acids, your, right. your B vitamins, your um, zinc, et cetera, in it. So right, it, right. it gives that boost. It's a nutritional, powerful um, supplement as well. Um, and again, uh, non-GMO, uh, pure, organic. That is cool. Yeah, it's it's way cool. And what is this? So yesterday, I only have a couple of these left. This is our sample pack. So if you go online for eleven dollars and ninety five cents, you get to try. Um, we have two tinctures of the five hundred milligram, and it is THC free. And then we also have the three um, packets of the Relief, Renew, and Revive creams. Okay. And so you get to pretty much um, try all of the core products, nice. I would say. And um, it gives a little history and it tells everything about the product and what's in it and what it, what it could be used for. Um, but that's kind of been my guide this weekend. And people who don't want to dive right into buying a whole bottle. Just a little bottle, taste, just to get a little something out of yeah. it and see if it works. But I have been able to sell a lot of the THC because what HempWorks does provide is a 60-day money-back guarantee. Empty bottle money-back guarantee. And you're not going to get that at a lot of the other places. You're not going to get that from anybody. No. And uh, so that's like the security blanket, I think, for people who, when they're purchasing product like this, that they're like, okay. And I'm like, they stand behind their product right. uh, 100%. Um, I have not seen anybody who's had to return it. Right. And I've not had to experience that yet. Uh, so, but I put that out there to let people know that, you know, money back guarantee. It's a win-win. It's a win-win. If you don't see the, you know, improvements, you know, right. to help reduce or improve, um, then, uh, you know, give me a call. And I coach people Thir through is it. Is it 30 days or 60 days? That'll last. So the 500 milligrams is a thousand drops. Okay. Uh, five times a day, um, uh, f two times a day, five drops underneath the tongue. Sorry. Right. And um, that'll last you about 45 days. 45 days. Okay. Um, I have a lot of couples coming, so right. I just let them know, you know, hey, if y'all are going to share this, if you're going to be consistent, it's right. going to be a little bit more than a, a 30 day supply. Okay. It's going to be underneath that 60 day window. Right. Um, but I also offer the coaching with it. That's so awesome. <clears throat> I'm not selling this and then I'm going to just send them on their way. Right. Um, I give them my website, um, I give them my email, my contact information, and I follow up with them within like a week after they've started to take this. I coach them through it. If they're not getting, you know, the uh, relief that they need, then we adjust and okay. we go from there. Got so I don't it. want people to feel like they're out on their own. Yeah. Here, uh, good luck. Yeah. So yeah. I think that's important um, that we need that coaching with it right. uh, just to kind of guide people through their journey. Okay. So. And and last but not least, last we have something for the puppy dogs. We got our furry friends are furry taking friends. care of. friends. Okay. So yeah. tell me about this. So we have uh, the dog treats. I sold a couple bags of this yesterday. They, uh, they have, uh, it's veterinary approved, it's natural. Um, there's 33 uh, dog treats in here for my little pup. Uh, I break that up in a few right. um, because she's so small and everything, but it's grain free, corn free, soybean free. Would this um, be good? So, okay, so we're in Florida and we're in thunderstorm season. Is this good to say, hey, yes. just to give it for d d before or during, just kind of calm them down a yeah, little bit? Yeah, well, and I sold my oil yesterday. So um, we have a 250 milligram uh, bottle of hemp oil for our, our CBD oil for our dogs. And my little dog, Suka, um, this year, 4th of July, she was not um, shaking yep. and she was not terrified. That is it awesome. really helped her through it. It's bacon flavored. Oh, that's even so, better. Oh, um, is she, it really? Yeah. Nom, she she nom, likes nom, the, uh, no, she likes the treats. Hey, let me tell you something. I've been through all this whole world. If, if, if this is approved by the, the veterinary system, whole nine yards, it's gone through that thing. It's yeah. safer to eat than most food on a shelf as for, for people. Yeah. I'm just saying, but okay. So, 
I know we've had it up on the bottom, but where do people find you and how do they get a hold of you? So um, www.hempworks.com slash SS Jackson is okay. my website. Uh, also on my card, we have like a sample website that right. I provide them and um, mdclifestyle.com slash SS Jackson will get you a free tour. So I tell people, I'm like, even if you want to buy, like, you've already bought this, take the tour, know about the product. Right. We're completely transparent. We have everything on the site. All of our product is from uh, Jen Connor in okay. Kentucky. It's Kentucky farmed. And Kentucky is really leading the way yes, of, um, of the farming. It's it's helping the farmers as well. So many jobs are being created by this. It's just All the amazing. coal miners that have been out of work now have a place to actually yeah, get to work. Yeah, absolutely. I've heard that already. So, yes, um, those that's my website. And then I also provide my you know email and stuff, um, contact information Excellent. on the card. And it's down there at the bottom as well. Perfect. Um, so, yeah. Miss Stephanie? Yes. Thanks for John. coming over and talking to us here. Oh my gosh, this, this is so is cool. Today. Look, if you're if you're really interested in the CBD world and you don't, I know there's a lot of people that really want to try it, but they're they're afraid yeah. because it, the connotation that's been with it for years and years and years has always been a bad. But it's not. It's really good. I've actually tried the product. I've actually tried this product myself and absolutely love the product. Yeah. So make sure if you're interested that you reach out to Miss Stephanie. She will take care of you. She will guide you along the way. She will tell you what you need and what you don't need. Yes. Because sometimes you don't need certain things and you it's true. It, you might think you do, but you don't, right? So, and that being said, we're going to go find some more people to bring them back and interview them. Thanks Miss Stephanie for stopping by. Thank we appreciate you, John. it. Appreciate it. Thanks. Hi, I am Delyn Gaston with WeBeam TV, and we are back here at the Orlando Home Show. So if you haven't come out to see this, you really should. I have a guest with me right now. This is Marcia Sauer from Hammock Treasures Handcrafted Soy Candles. These look so awesome and smell Thank even you. better. Thank Welcome, you. Marcia. Thank Thanks you for so joining much. us. My pleasure. Have you had a good show so far? This has been uh, a lot of traffic. We're getting a lot of traffic. Much busier show than I thought. Yeah, that I, I, I've I been feeling the same yeah. way. So um, tell us about these. I've been by your booth a couple of times. Just smells, these smell amazing. I didn't realize you make these yourself. I do make them myself. Tell us about that. So I have a, a lovely little craft room because um, I like to make jewelry and all kinds of stuff and uh, I got set up with a, a nice melting pot and a table and I have my wax flakes underneath and I have racks where I store them after I've labeled them and I just work in my room all day long. How do you come up with your scents and your ideas and things like that? Um, I have a uh, I have two two main stores that I uh, like to use and I'll go on there and we'll read read them and see what they're uh, top notes are, base notes, okay. see what appeals to me. Being at the beach, I tend to really gravitate towards things that are tropical. Um, right, right. And, and that's that's good and bad because not everywhere is the beach, so I have to get out of that a little bit because I could do all <laughs> beach scents if I was allowed to. Um, and we'll just buy a little one. They'll sell you little one-ounce uh, samples. Oh, okay. And you can make that in a small candle, and if you love it, boom, you're done. You order it in big, and I have all my scents lined up in shelves. Okay. And um, some things don't go over well. I was we'll going to say, but it's something that you don't say, like, okay, and you go, uh -uh. And that makes room for another new new scent which is okay. really fun for me I'm so like, I was imagining yeah you change those out quite a bit and I, seasonal too so we'll, oh yeah, we'll really true. get a big stash for the holidays and then that goes back in a corner and then right summer now sure. comes and I, I try to do more things that'll you know flowery and spring with, summer yep, kind of stuff fall. and right now we have fall so probably pumpkin mm -hmm. I would imagine is kind of a biggie Banana, going on bread, you got a pumpkin, pumpkin thing. souffle and right. we've got cranberry spice and Fraser fir getting into and, nutmeg pretty yeah. soon <laughs> yeah pine yeah. coming up okay so um how long does it take to make these well it starts with um I have to clean the bottle out to get the sticker to the wick to stick and that's a process because it has to be windexed every single bottom of every candle. Oh. Then I have a huge tub of wax flakes that go in the melter. Okay. And I have to have the temperatures going on that. I have to see the temperature of where it's melting and the temperature of what I'm pouring it into when it's melted. Oh. Certain temperatures, then you can add your fragrance. Mm -hmm. You have to stir, 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 stir. Then that has to cool so that all your vessels that you have lined up, whether they're the small or the big or the melts, everything I have lined up, and I'll just pour 
mix, pour, mix, and I just fill everything up. Then you have to level the wick so that it's perfect with a stick or, you know, everybody right. uses something different. Right. And then you can't move them till they're cool. They can't be moved because if I pick this up while it's liquid, then it's all slurped right. up the side. And it's so you have it's to just put straight. everything in a spot where it can just do its thing and cool. Then I can go and mix another batch of something else and you just keep going. Then they get labeled top and bottom and the wicks clipped lids on them so that the fragrance stays nice and fresh and then they go in my in order on my racks and then i move to another one so hours hours, hours it's hard to, to say take. now and how long so something longer time this size, when I'm layering because i have to let every layer cool i know this one is as awesome, i pour it again it? so this this one is called beach, beach blanket, blanket which i think is just so cool and my favorite out of all these scents that here. was devin's idea make it look like a blanket mom so that very people don't smart pass it by, that so. is one smart daughter you have there it worked. So um, how long does the average candle of this size burn and of this size this burn? This size will last you 120 hours. Wow. Which is a lot longer than a paraffin candle. Soy burns so much longer and cooler. Oh. This one is 60 and we didn't bring the smaller one. Uh, that one is 30 hours and they completely evaporate. It goes all the way down to the bottom. Okay. And uh, it doesn't release uh, the toxins and the emissions like a paraffin candle. It just disappears. You don't get the soot. You don't get the coating. Really? So they're okay. very much cleaner And candle. why? So a cleaner burn. Mm -hmm. And why does it burn longer than the paraffin? It's the soy. It just, it's, soy. It just, it's liquid and you get the fragrance. And then when it cools, it goes right back to this. And it just slides down the jar. Usually there's nothing left. Nothing. And there's no hole down the Especially middle. Especially if you've let it, if you light it and you let it burn all the way across to where your liquid is completely level then blow it out then that's the memory and it will completely go down like that if you were to burn it and leave oh. that melted just in the middle and say i gotta go somewhere and take off sometimes that will tunnel because that's the soft spot that you've created and it'll follow that oh. so you should burn every candle no matter what size no matter where you got it make sure you have enough time that it's going to burn blow it out about how long does that usually take any idea you know um 20 minutes to an hour attention. depends on the, okay. the candle not long okay. really not long smaller candles will do it very quickly you know okay. because it's it's it doesn't have as wide of a pool right. to make now you have some really interesting tips on the back of your card as well that that um that i didn't realize so let's go over these real quick so people know with burning can i don't know i know a lot of people love to burn candles i love to burn candles um but, and I did not know some of these things. Mm -hmm. So tell us about these tips. All right, let me see what we have written because I don't have that memorized yet. So um, the first burn, so we just talked about how that, that should be clear all the way across before you blow it out. Also trimming your wicks to a quarter of an inch because if you were to light this, and I, and mm -hmm. I really should now clip these because I think people are burning them this length and this is just an out the door length it's not a clip length oh, um, a quarter so of an inch should... because this will burn and smoke like crazy because it's so tall right so I'm assuming that people would I, I, I assumed that so yes. we put it on there no put they it don't to a quarter of an inch and then light it um, I did not know that yep. so you need to trim it okay we usually say four hours at a time because this gets really even though soy burns cooler mm -hmm. um it can crack your glass if you're not careful if you oh. if it, you've let it get really really all liquid and you've been six eight hours it's just not good we say blow that out get you another candle light it once that's cooled you can relight it again but four hours is the safest okay um for yeah me. i'm famous for li lighting it on a saturday morning doing housework and everything you totally know forget where the heat is coming from or, the, or that little bit of smoke could set off a sensor or something right. in your house mm -hmm. i know somebody that <clears throat> did that by burning a whole <laughs> bunch at one time. Whoops. <laughs> a little candle off. freak over there. <laughs> I think set, set off the sensors. That's a fire the alarm. <laughs> <laughs> whoops. Yeah. Yeah. Whoops. But oh, um, I funny. was also telling you, which I think I'd love to start carrying the, the candle scissors. Yes. Because you can go right in with the scissor. They're the long way with the little round bowl and you just go in and so clip when it your gets wick down. and you can pull that little mushroom black piece off and you never have that in your candle because that makes me crazy. When yes. I see my beautiful candle with all that black with all in that there. Black on yeah. It. So you yes. can just get your candle scissors and they just go clip and they pull that right oh, out. Wow. And That's they're very excellent. inexpensive. So I just need to find some wholesale so that I can have some. And sometimes they're just beautiful. Like they're very ornate. Oh, nice. Yeah, it's kind of a neat little, and a snuffer. And they, a sometimes snuffer. they come with a snuffer. That way you don't have all that when you oh, blow that it out. Oh, would be nice. Heat blowing out and then all that, Yeah. you know. So goes, you can snuff it and it just sort of simmers it. Nice. It's just kind of cool. So those little extras, if you're a candle person, 
I think everyone should have them in their stockings for stuffers. Yes, I think there that you would go. be a cool way if you don't know what to get someone, not just yeah. buy them a candle, but buy them the equipment to go with it. You're right. Yeah. You're right. That is very good. So um, do you do any um, by order if somebody says, hey, we I really have... found this scent that I really loved, but it was up in Canada when I was there last summer or whatever? I will do a special order if I can get it. Okay. Absolutely. Um, I don't have to buy a large quantity. You can buy a smaller amount, right. make a couple candles and you're done. And say, hey, is this uh -huh. it? Is this what so you're looking for? I will That's do that nice. for anyone. Yeah. yeah. Or colors. Yeah, like, I can like do a we're custom talking color. about breast cancer awareness coming up. So you could do a pink candle mm -hmm. for breast cancer I did, awareness um, or something. Nice. A football candle. Uh, a girl ordered um, some gator candles from me. Say. <laughs> and I did some orange and blue ones and named them Gators Chomp. They're super cute. But again, that takes a long time to make. So I can't pump them out as quickly as I could a, a white candle. But right. they turned out so cute. So I didn't bring them because that wasn't fair to anybody else's football team. I just, you know, but for and, special and order, I, I would say, do that. Yeah, and you are yeah. at UCF territory yeah. here, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, fair. that is awesome. So tell everybody how they can reach you. I know we have your website up yeah. here. Um, you are online. HammockTreasures.com. Yep. And um, all over the world you ship? Yeah, we can ship anywhere. Cool. Yeah. So it would be great for Christmas gifts or something like that. A lot of people have family up north or something. Yep. They can yep. send them up there. Yep. Send have, them a little bit a of beach blankets. Up north, a little bit of sea salt <laughs> summer, yes, right? Yes. Oh, and when because uh, Life's a Beach has um, some shells in it. So oh. you could get you could be in Vermont and have a little bit of a little taste oh, of the ocean. See, because that would that be one lovely. Smells like jasmine and uh, suntan lotion. That's one of my favorite. Life's a beach. I love that one. Nice. So yeah, that would be neat to have a little taste of the beach. See, when that's you're good. Maybe in Alaska or something. So so on your website, all these and all of the yep. scents and everything, yep. and they can just order and get shipped out. That is perfect. Yep. Thank you, yeah, Marcia. Thank it's you. been wonderful having you here. That's very interesting. Well, I'm very to blessed know. to be here. All right. Thank you, everyone. We will be right back at the home show. Hey, guys, welcome back. This is Weave Gene TV. My name is Russell Taylor. I'm here with Blake from Momentum Solar. Momentum Solar. There it is. All right. Yes. Excuse me, guys. Okay. So, Mo Momentum Solar, what do you guys do over there? So, I mean, it's right there in the name solar. You know, I mean, uh, we live in the Sunshine State, so it seemed as good a place to any. <laughs> definitely, <laughs> to definitely. Kind of, kind of bring down a new branch, bring you know, open it up, get the retail mar market established here. Okay, uh, so you guys put solar in the houses so that yes, we can sir. save on our electric bills, exactly. right? Exactly. So awesome, awesome. So when you guys um, come in and you, I come to you, like we're at the, the Tampa Bay Home Show today, over here at the Tampa Bay Convention Center. Um, I come to you, I say, hey, Blake. I'm interested in solar. What's the process from there? What do you guys do? What sets you aside from all the other solar companies out there? Um, well, well like, again, it's a great question. Um, I will never sit here and say that we're better than anyone. Um, that's not up for me to decide. It's obviously up to you and really anyone else is kind of interested in it. Um, but what makes us different is the fact that we are the largest privately held solar company in the entire country. We operate in nine states. Um, we have a a plus rating with a better business bureau so that's awesome yeah, exactly so do you guys are you guys like some of the other companies out there that I'm gonna deal with Blake right you're gonna be my sales guy you're gonna come in you're gonna look at my house you're gonna tell me how much I'm gonna save and then you're gonna turn me over to another contractor or do you guys have your contractors that are a part of your business and you guys see things from A to Z is that how you do it or we do you do, guys yeah, have we, yeah, we, we do it from A to Z okay awesome um, awesome now Personally, it's not going to be me that comes out to your home. Obviously, it'll be somebody much better looking, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> um, no, my job at, here at the home show is I'm, I'm the angel Gabriel. Okay. Yeah, ha have you heard the good news? Yes. My job is to get you in touch with the guy um, who will come on out and show you what we're about. Take a look at your electric bill. Get you a price right down to the penny. Take awesome. a look at your roof. We won't go up there. Okay. And we won't bring the panels or anything, but we do want to at least make sure there's four walls and a roof. You know, okay. and we want to be able to at least take a look at the roof and then we'll take a satellite image of it. That way we could see how much square footage we're working with, determine what your needs are, see how many panels we could put up there to match your needs and then get you a price right down to the penny. Okay. So you can get this price. Um, what sets you guys apart as far as the warranty and all of that? I mean, um, in the industry, that's a big thing for us, right? This is a, Absolutely. this is a, this is an investment. We're talking about, we're working on the largest investment that we have, which is our home. And then, so we're adding to it, but um, 
and then there's a residual to this. So we're going to have a long-term savings on, yeah, you're on the product. You're long-term savings. But what's the warranty? Am I covered for one year or am I covered for five years? Covered, lifetime? covered for a lifetime. Lifetime. Of, of your home. Of the home. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I don't know about you, but I'm a <laughs> former chef, so I'm a smoker and drinker. Okay. So thank God, not my lifetime. <laughs> you know? um, but look, let's just say, Russ, man, you, you're tired of living in Florida for some really weird reason and you want to move. Mm -hmm. And you have Momentum's panels on your roof. We'll put the warranty in the next homeowner's name. Okay. So, again, it's for the lifetime of the home. What I see a lot of people doing, especially now, being that there is a lot of homes going up on the market, is I see people doing these last-minute home improvement projects, so to speak. Something that kind of creates value for the next homeowner. Whether it's solar or gutter protection or whatever the case is, most of this, that stuff is going to come with a lifetime warranty. That way, you get what you pay for, for sure. And... You're a nice guy to the next to the, to the next people, you know. Definitely, definitely awesome. So, lifetime warranty. Yes, sir. If they wanted to come and see you, where could they? See you? If you're not here at the Tampa um, show, you guys have an office in Tampa. We do. They can always find us on Moment online at momentumsolar.com. Momentumsolar.com. Okay, so guys, um, we make have sure a sheet on there. They can they can fill out, and we'll be get right in touch with them, confirm awesome. that appointment, and Bob's perfect. Will come on out. Definitely. So, guys. If you are looking for solar power for your house, make sure you guys stop by, see Momentum Solar at the Tampa Bay Convention Center today for the Tampa Bay Home Show, or go to their website, or you can go to their office down in Tampa Bay, Florida, and um, always make sure you ask for Blake or one of his teammates. Lifetime warranties, save money on your bill, everything, great company. Guys, come out and see us. It's We're win, here today win, win. at... Definitely a win-win. We're here at the Tampa Bay Home Show at the Tampa Bay Convention Center, WeBeam TV. Thank you, guys. We'll see you soon. What a ride. I know. Welcome back. Thanks for sticking around with us and watching the cool stuff that we found. We're going to do multiple, multiple. We probably have enough footage here For to do several several shows so this one happened this all was from orlando um we are at the orange county convention center today the central so florida this... home show september 2019 edition right. i had to do it by the month and date and some of the other stuff we didn't get to mention. One of our favorites, Dot's oh. pretzels. So this is another one, guys. And I'm just going to do a really quick plug on this. These are like the best pretzels you ever ate. And you cannot buy them. Well, you can buy them in, I think they're in a couple of wine stores. Yes. Um, but for the most part, you're going to have to go online. So look them up, Dot's pretzels, because oh, they're really good, they too. They are so Tons of really good stuff good. here today. Some stuff that we didn't get to. Of course, our, our um, Polka Dot's pet, pet Rescue. We wanted to mention that yep, a little yep. more. Um, and then the there's mattress stuff. There's all kinds of stuff. You guys really should check out um, some of these home shows that are going around town. They are so cool. Like and the a lady, lot of them have show specials. Yes, they do. Like we have a guy across the street. That it's called the Eco Trikes, mm -hmm. and they're a little yeah, three wheeler are, trike. Those are cute. That's Ian. Oh my God, those are some really really cool. I mean, what a great mode of transportation. Thirty miles and do eighteen miles an hour or something like that. And it, it's it to me. I keep trying to talk to my wife because they're one that matches my truck. But anyway, yeah, no. then we had the lady across. <laughs> another lady across from us is the Hula Coolers. There was Gator World Those are the was here. That you put over oh, your neck you heat them up in the microwave heat or cool. Heat or, or cool. cool yep, depending yep. upon what you need for uh, muscles or relaxation. Some that go over your eyes, over your face for headaches and things right. like that. There's some cool stuff. So Chef Warren was here. Yeah, cooking, Chef teaching Warren. people how to cook the right he's amazing. way. Amazing, and he's got some great cookbooks. Oh and yeah, some fast. So you know, yeah. you're working people or whatever. You get home and you need some quick meals or, or table for two. You know, maybe you're making a romantic meal Ooh. for you and your special someone. That's called that's called grilled cheese and tomato soup. Yeah, <laughs> it's about as romantic. So romantic. As we get. <laughs> um, and our and our and our friends from Ario Relief were here. And they have that new line, the new CBD line that's been infused. It's it's absolutely phenomenal, good stuff. Um, I mean, it's just, there was so much here. This, I mean, really, John Madison Landscaping was here. from you know He's from Orlando over in the area up here. That dude is absolutely cool. And again, and you got to watch Kevin, the shows. And we met Kevin, security, talking about security. And, oh, yeah, and we all actually that met the awesome. security guy that actually, not only does he have his private side, but he's he actually runs security for some of these events. Kevin is a really interesting yeah. person and um, and does security for like homeowners associations and things like that. So 
Yeah, we even had we even had a, a, a boot a down from us that had a bonsai trees. I, I love and how, that. And, and then they would tell you how to take care of them the right way. Right. Because there's the wrong way. And did not people, know that a lot of people take care of them the wrong way. That's right. We learn the things That's right. we learn. So thank you for watching the home show. Continue to watching the home show. Look, support the people that we put on here for you because we I, I believe that we gave everybody some great information. Mm -hmm. I mean, we even we even showed you how to to get down to Costa Rica. I know. Oh my gosh! My I mean, Melissa from Costa Rica. Not only can you everybody do a rental, wants to. But you can buy, right? Yes, you can buy See, or vacation rentals. We bring you way. everything. So with that being said, we appreciate you watching. Stay tuned for more of The Home Show. We'll see you at the next Home Show.